Hi guys, welcome back to my channel, Unique Tarot. This is going to be a reading for the sign of Scorpio. Scorpio, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, North Node, January 5 and 6 for Scorpio. Scorpio, please, Spirit, Guides, Angels, Universe, what's the messages for Scorpio? Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus for Scorpio. Next, 48, January 5 and 6 for Scorpio. Someone rising in Venus for Scorpio. What's the messages here for Scorpio, please? Scorpio. First card I want to flip over is the lovers, Gemini energy. So this is a connection. This is how you feel for someone. Or this could be a decision between two people, but this is two people being in love or you're in love with someone or, or, or this could even be sex. Okay, we have the Four of Cups, the Queen of Swords, Seven of Pentacles, Ace of Wands, and the Empress. So I feel like you're very attracted to a Libra. Libra is here heavy. The Empress could be a baby mama or it could just be a Libra. Someone that's very beautiful, very attractive with the Ace of Wands. Someone could also be pregnant. I'm getting a positive pregnancy test. I feel like somebody like pee, peeing on a stick and then they're waiting for it to see what it says. I'm getting someone finding out that they are pregnant. Okay. Anyways, okay. This is you or somebody you know, Scorpio or whatever. It could be this Libra or whatever. But I feel like I feel like honestly, there you could be dealing with two Libras. Okay. One I feel like is is very cold or you don't talk to or you're disinterested in or you're not attracted to anymore or you don't really fuck with. And then there's another one you're very much attracted to. This could be a baby mama with the Empress card. The Empress is the most beautiful in the deck. Absolutely beautiful. What is the lover's card for Scorpio? Scorpio. Summer rising Venus and North Node. January 5 and 6 for Scorpio. So, yeah, we got the moon card. Yeah, so I'm getting something about a secret lover or a secret affair. Someone's definitely secretly cheating. This is you or the person that you're dealing with that's doing this. Could be a Libra, but somebody is definitely secretly cheating. Okay? Okay, or you are. All right, what's the messages? So I feel like there's there's something being hidden about a lover or something being hidden about a Cancer or a Gemini or a Libra or whoever the fuck it is. I definitely keep hearing secret cheating. So someone is secretly cheating or there's some there is a secret pregnancy or someone thinks that it's a, a secret. Yeah, we have the two of pentacles. OK. I'm definitely getting multiple lovers or someone's juggling lovers or something like that. Yeah, we have the Queen of Pentacles and the Six of Pentacles. All right. We have the Knight of Swords wanting to flip out in reverse. So there's a delays or something's in, unstable. We have the Queen of Pentacles. I'm hearing something about a mother. There's delays or something is inconsistent here with the mother. Yeah, the Five of Pentacles. Someone's ass could be getting put out or... If someone's homeless or someone's struggling here or yeah yeah these are your cards scorpio five of cups and tower so you're disappointed you're sad or you're out bad or you're not doing well financially or maybe you're homeless or someone's getting put out or something's unstable here or something's inconsistent what is this what is this for scorpio let me scoot this up just a little bit. Okay. What is this for Scorpio? Scorpio, January 5 and 6. So I feel like something about money or money that someone is giving you is, it, yeah, 10 of cups flipped out perfectly in the reverse. So I feel like you're unhappy, maybe with your family or in this relationship or with this person. It could be an earth sign. It could be a Cancerian or a Gemini. A Cancer or a Gemini is here. An earth sign could be involved. Yeah, we have the Five of Swords. What is this? Yeah, the Ten of Cups in reverse. What is this? Because I feel like somebody's trying to cause something in somebody's life. We have the Higher Found in the reverse. Taurus energy, Gemini, and um, Cancer. Yeah, Ten of Swords. 
I feel like somebody, yeah. The higher found in the reverse is something. Uh, 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 yeah, we have the Knight of Cups, the Page of Swords, the, the Ace of Pentacles, Two of Cups. I feel like somebody wants to break their silence or the worst part of a situation is over. Somebody wants to apologize or come back together or make up or offer you something or give you something here or this is you. The higher found in the reverse could be a marriage that is over. If somebody was juggling a marriage and somebody else, I feel like somebody's dropping their marriage or dropping this long-term commitment or this government institution or this community or whatever the fuck this is going on or this family, somebody's dropping that. I feel like somebody's not happy with this lover or with this Gemini or with these multiple lovers. I just feel like that somebody's not happy with that shit anymore. Or somebody just feels, yeah, the higher fun in the reverse. Or someone's worried about losing this Taurus or this commitment or this marriage. What's the two of pentacles for Scorpio? Yeah, the three of swords. Yeah, something that's on and off a breakup. I feel like something's going to be broke. Something's going to be, um, yeah, the seven of swords. There's definitely infidel. I knew it. Infidelity is lying and cheating here. Three of swords, seven of swords is absolutely infidelities, lying, cheating, and being sneaky with the moon card and the lover. Somebody, a, a cheater, just period. I don't know. I feel like it's a female energy, but it could be a male. I feel like there is, there is, I keep hearing Libra. And so if somebody's dealing with a Libra specifically, you, they're being cheated on. A Libra woman is cheating on your ass or they've been cheating on you. For seven months or seven years or however long you've been with this person or whatever this is. Or you've been doing it still. You know which side. Okay. But let's see. Yeah, we got to be someone's lying about a kid or a child or a home or something. Okay. It happens. So, yeah, we have somebody that's juggling with the two of pentacles and the lovers. That's a decision. Someone's juggling two people and they're cheating on both or cheating on each other with them or something like that what's the queen of pentacles the sun card coming out in the reverse okay two of the happiest cards in the deck are both coming out in the reverse so i feel like you're not happy at all scorpio or this is or this is someone else a leo a taurus a cancer or a gemini I feel like somebody's in bad health as well. Somebody's health is not good at all. Knight of Swords in reverse could be a speech impediment or somebody that, that speaks a different language. There could be a language barrier here. You may not be able to understand what someone is saying. Also, I'm also getting delays and inconsistency here with money or 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 something. Yeah, we have Leo again here. So a Leo could be significant, a Taurus, a Cancer, or a Gemini. It could be an Earth sign, a Capricorn. What is the Knight of Swords in reverse for Scorpio? January 5 and 6 for my Scorpio. January 5 and 6. All right, we have the Star card. That wanted to pop out a few seconds ago, so it's back out, so that's significant. The Page of Swords. I feel like you could be in the public eye, a healer, an influencer of some sort, or this is someone that you're watching with the Page of Swords. Stalking, or they're stalking you. You know what side of this you're on. And the Knight of Cups. Two of Swords, Ten of Swords, Seven of Swords. So I feel like somebody wants to apologize here for lying, for cheating, for conning, for something that they said, something that they didn't say. Maybe somebody has a sharp tongue or a sharp mouth. Somebody wants to apologize for that or they want to break their silence or they want to say something to fix a situation here. You have the four pentacles in the reverse. I feel like somebody wants to get somebody to open up here. But there's delays or somebody has someone blocked or something ain't moving forward. I feel like somebody yet is heartbroken or sad, or this could be an ex, this could be you, or this could be someone else that wants to speak out, or someone that's very much in their head about a situation here. Yeah, the judgment. What is the, what, what is the um, star card? What is this? Yeah, we got the page of pentacles in the reverse, the seven of swords. So something in, is in reverse. So seven of swords in reverse is something coming out, lies being revealed. Something was revealed here about a liar, a cheater, a con. 
Yeah, we have the page of pentacles in the reverse. Somebody does not want to communicate. They don't want to hear shit. They don't want to talk. I feel like somebody sees someone as a liar and they just don't trust them. This could be someone you live with with the four of wands. I feel like somebody just don't trust somebody or they just don't want to talk. Yeah, here's this Libra again with the justice card. This could also be a legal situation, okay? That some of you could be going through. Yeah, the emperor and the page of wands. I'm definitely, yeah, we have the eight of swords. I'm definitely getting feeling stuck or... Or something, something. Okay, hold on, because that's nasty. <laughs> hold on, hold on. I need a motherfucking. Should I get it? Yeah. One second. Okay. All right. So I feel like somebody feels stuck or they're fearful here or something's not being said or 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 something. Yeah, we have the Emperor, Aries energy, Aquarius energy, Cancer, Gemini, and Taurus, Leo energy here as well. So we have the Emperor, okay? So I feel like somebody, what's the Emperor yet? Yeah, a death card. This is you, Scorpio. So I feel like something is changing here. Somebody with the letter M or W in their name could be significant. What is the Emperor? Yeah, we have the nine of swords. I just feel like somebody's going. So somebody could be very, very much stuck in their head here about a situation or trying to heal a situation. I feel like somebody's not happy here. Someone's realizing that they need to let go of a child or they're going to have to or their, their child doesn't want to be a part of their life or doesn't want to fuck with them or doesn't fuck with them or somebody here don't fuck with their their children or something. Yeah, the Knight of Pentacles. Someone could also be worried about jail or, or going to jail or something here. I'm definitely getting something about being locked up or the police coming to someone's home or... or uh, we have the page of, or probation officers. We have the page of cups, knight of cups, two of swords, three of swords. I feel like somebody is confused or somebody wants to apologize or somebody wants to say something here that they may be cussed, get the, they may be worried about being cussed out or something. Yeah, this is definitely a third party situation. Someone's definitely being cheated on, lied to. Someone's being juggled and someone's sneaking behind somebody's back. I'm just going to keep it 100, man. I feel like that's important for somebody to know. So we have Aries here, Taurus. We have Cancer, Gemini, Aquarius, Leo, and Aries, okay? We have Ten of Wands and Justice. So this could be a legal situation. We have the Eight of Wands, Ace of Pentacles, and the Chariot. So this could definitely be something about like communication or reaching out to someone. Someone could want to give you something, Scorpio, or this is you. That's wanting to reach out to someone or give someone something. What's this magician card right here? What is this magician card right here? January 5 and 6 for Scorpio. Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. North Node as well for Scorpio. January 5 and 6. We have the Seven of Pentacles and the Wheel of Fortune. The Three of Pentacles, the Six of Pentacles, and the Nine of Pentacles. So I feel like something is shifting in your career and your money or in somebody else's. But I feel like, uh, what is the seven of pentacles? I feel, what is this, the temperate Sagittarius energy here? I feel like something could be balancing out in finances here. Okay. Yeah, we have the page of wands in reverse. So, in the ten of wands. So something is not good in the seven of wands. So I feel like something is being blocked here. 
or, or, or there's, yeah, with the Seven of Wands and the Page of Wands in reverse, this could be some kind of news regarding something that someone's being blocked here. Or someone's being rejected for this offer. or So if you're waiting on an answer or waiting for something, an answer to come back regarding the situation, I'm getting it's going to be a no. Yep, the higher fine in the reverse, the ten of cups in reverse. I feel like you're going to be unhappy. Something's not going to move forward or, or something's not going to go in your favor or in somebody else's. You know what side of this you're on. Yeah, we have the knight of wands. Okay, yeah, the ace of wands. This could be something new that you're trying to do or something that you're trying to implement. I feel like it's going to be rejected or something's not going to move how you're wanting it to move here. Yeah, the two of wands. This could also be about travel. There could be delays in traveling or something for some of you. And we have the devil card, okay? Could be dealing with a Capricorn. Yeah, not, oh, this is, wait, this stack is too big. But we have the Queen of Swords, Libra in energy, okay? And the Eight of Cups. Yeah, we have the king, the king of pentacles in the reverse. So I don't know here, um, but I feel like something as far as like money, like somebody's going cold or somebody's not giving you some money anymore. Or someone's not helping you somebody anymore. Somebody feels like they need to help themselves. Somebody could also be healing from an illness or a sickness here. Oh my God, judgment in the reverse. This deck is not in reverse. So if these cards are flipping out perfectly in the reverse, that's for a reason, okay? Because I, I, I really do feel like, um, I really do feel like, yeah, the judgment in reverse, that could be bad karma or the universe blocking something here. Someone's stuck. In financial crisis or somebody's money is not doing so well. Yeah, four of pentacles in the reverse. I feel like there's an earth sign that's tired of helping somebody or tired of, of tired of caring for someone. Yeah, the nine of cups, but it's getting what you want here. Or being what's the nine of cups? Or being satisfied at work? Or be or, or no, or being satisfied in a home situation? What is this? Oh my God, 10 of Pentacles in the reverse. So there's a loss of money or a loss in somebody's fortune or their money here. What's the 10 of Pentacles? The High Priestess, the Chariot, and the Justice. What is the 10 of Pentacles right here? The King of Cups and the King of Swords. The water sign, so. So this could be a home situation. Yeah, the Death card and the Ace of Cups. So I feel like something is transforming here with a family member or a family situation or maybe or maybe with your money. If you were being blocked or things were slow or stagnant here, maybe, th I, I don't know, something could be picking up as far as work or with family or something could be changing around that. I'm getting a new opportunity. Something's or someone's or there, there could be, yeah, the four of cups and the will of fortune. Yeah, something could be shifting here or changing. This could also be forgiveness. Somebody could be forgiving you or you're forgiving someone yeah three of pentacles ten of wands and the justice with the four swords that's double libran right there the two of cups in the world and two of swords or libran again five of cups and the yeah so i feel like something's changing or something about work or something is very maybe there's a lot of work or a lot of struggling here as far as work i feel like something is going to shift or change here yeah the Six of Pentacles and the Queen of Cups. Or someone's going to help someone here. Or you're going to get help if you need it. Yeah, Nine of Pentacles, the Fool, the Seven of Wands, the Knight of Cups, Five of Swords, and the Devil. 
I feel like somebody, I feel like you need to be careful or somebody else needs to be careful of your ass. I feel like there's a Capricorn or somebody somewhere that's very jealous. They could be trying to project or send negative energy to somebody. I feel like somebody's really attracted to what somebody does for work. They really want to fuck with them, but they're really jealous and hateful of them as well. Or this is your ass, Scorpio. Yeah, what's the Eight of Pentacles? Oh, but I feel like, yeah, the Fool, the Eight of Pentacles, yeah, the Seven of Wands. I feel like you want to apologize to somebody, but they have you blocked with the Seven of Wands, or they don't want to hear it, or they just don't give a fuck. Or this is you. But I definitely, I definitely see something changing here. Yeah, we have the King of Wands falling out in the reverse. That's somebody that's very controlling or narcissistic, or somebody that could be very abusive. Somebody that lacks integrity. That's what I'm getting here. Like a lot of somebody lacks integrity here or something. Yeah, the page of cups in reverse. I just feel like somebody does not want to hear somebody's apology. They don't want to talk. They're cold. They just don't give a fuck. I feel like somebody's completely detached from a situation here. They're focused on their work or all they want is their money or you need to pay them what you owe them or whatever the fuck this is. I feel like somebody doesn't want to have a conversation about shit. They want their fucking money. I, I feel like somebody's a liar, a cheater. They they juggle, they lie, they con. Somebody could be very hateful here. Yeah, the the two of swords in reverse. Somebody's trying to get somebody to open up. It could be a Libra to open up to take down their defenses or their guard. Yeah, the six of swords in reverse and the tower in the reverse. Somebody's trying to come back. Six of swords is coming back to a situation. I feel like somebody's bringing the tower down on themselves. But whatever this is, they're trying to do. Something could be backfiring on somebody's ass. What's the tower in reverse? What is this tower in reverse spirit for Scorpio? Yeah, we have justice in the reverse. Damn. And ten of wands in reverse. So this could be justice in reverse is, is bad karma. Somebody could be have brought bad karma on themselves by trying to stop someone or stagnate someone or do some kind of spell work yeah here's this libra again i feel like a situation yep i knew it the devil somebody's been doing um a spell work trying to delay someone trying to stop somebody and it has brought a lot of bad karma on somebody or somebody something's backfiring with the tower in reverse or something blew up in somebody's face Somebody tried to end somebody else's career or their money or stagnate them, and instead it fucked them up. I also get somebody is very sick. Yeah, we have the Six of Cups. This could be someone from your past, Scorpio, or this is your ass. Could be dealing with a Capricorn, a Libra, a Gemini, a Cancer, a Taurus, an Aries, a Sagittarius, an Aquarius, a Leo, or Scorpio like yourself. Yeah, we have the Five of Swords and the Knight of Cups. So I feel like somebody wants to apologize, but it's only because they're jealous, they're vindictive, they're hateful, and they can't win. They try to beat you or try to cause chaos in your life, and they can't. So now they want to come in and apologize, but it's to get their way in a situation or or something. Yeah, Ace of Swords, that's the truth. Do not trust this person and do not take... I said that in Virgo's reading. Do not take a motherfucking thing from this person. Do not deal with this person whatsoever or this is or they don't need to deal with your ass scorpio but somebody here is on some like real trickery type shit or they're trying to be on some trickery type shit or they're trying to something it's not gonna work yeah look at that the high priestess somebody is too intelligent and they're a high priestess they're fucking psychic they know exactly what you're trying to attempt or what you're trying to do they know they're clear ace of swords is being clear this could be an air sign Air signs rule the cerebral, cort the cerebral cortex. Libras, Gemini, and Aquarius. They know every fucking thing, and especially if they're a high priestess, a psychic. So if you're trying to come in and apologize to someone, someone knows you're hateful, jealous of them, you're envious, you're low down, and you're a cunt. They know that, Scorpio, or you do. So don't try to play this person or come back in this person. Don't try to get nobody to help you talk to them. This person don't want to talk to your ass, your family, or none of y'all hoes. Or this is you. I feel like somebody ass gonna get cussed the fuck out if they try to, especially they try to go towards this Libra. Because I've been picking up Libra and your shit heavy. So my ass is gonna get tore off the fucking frame. And anybody else that tries to come towards them. 
Somebody is not apologetic for their behavior. Somebody is not apologetic for anything. I don't see any cards here. The Knight of Cups is apologizing, but it, the Five of Swords is behind it. So somebody's apologizing for their own selfish reason or to be vindictive or nasty or because they're really jealous of you. What's the Five of Swords? This person has attempted to do spell work on you and it backfired on their ass. That's not working. So now somebody want to be your best friend or now somebody want to wake up, um, make up or whatever the fuck this is. Yeah. You see what I'm saying? Five of Wands. Somebody's in competition with you. They're jealous. Yeah, nine of Pentacles in reverse. Somebody's, yeah, three of Pentacles. Somebody's trying to, yeah, the Empress in reverse. Six of Cups. Somebody's really jealous, hateful, and envious. Somebody's trying to do spell work to fuck with somebody's confidence. Or because they can't compete with them. They already tried that um, by trolling somebody. Making up fake accounts. Trying to troll them. That ain't working. So let me, let me, um, they, they did that and try to fuck up somebody's self-esteem. Yeah, the Empress in reverse, somebody's trying to fuck with someone's self-esteem or their beauty with spell work. That didn't work. So let me be fake and apologize and act like everything cool. But somebody knows what someone's trying to do. They're not going for it. Or someone's trying to get someone to, to, to shut up or end some, or end something for somebody. It's not going to work. Somebody's still going to be that bitch. Somebody's still going to win. And, and, and somebody ain't going no motherfucking where. I can guarantee you that. Yeah, the four swords. I feel like somebody try to make somebody sick and lose and lose their their money and their and their confidence and everything. Somebody here is pathetic as fuck. Their career. Somebody try to bring somebody's whole career down, and somebody got karma for that shit. Bad karma. Somebody else's shit is about to be. Somebody else's shit is about to be fucked up. Yeah, whoever this star is, or whoever's in the public eye, or whoever is popular here, or whatever. I feel like somebody, 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 something has backfired, or it's about to real bad. So whatever the spell work, yeah, Virgo energy, yep, backfire. Seven of Wands. Whatever the spell work you're doing every day, or they're doing, or whoever this is, just be prepared to lose all your shit. Be prepared. Because something is not going to happen to this other person. Someone here is chosen. Whoever this is in the public eye, whoever this influencer is, whoever this person is, nothing's going to happen to them. But everything is going to happen to your ass. You can mark my words. So those are your messages. Make sure to like, comment, subscribe, and share this video.